The reason Harvey Weinstein was brought forward was so that no one would look at Mike Lang, his boss from Miramax Films. So when Miramax Films, when he leaves, keep in mind, Joel Silver leaves the same time Mike Lang does, and he draws away without someone to replace him, it becomes Harvey Weinstein. The Variety article goes on to say things like, Miramax has this library, 800 million in 2011. It's gone up. It's in a Jersey warehouse. Film Tracks is where he's going to go as a consultant now to continue the process of the strategy to acquire intellectual property they don't own my work. And then you get this thing with Joel Silver leaving at the same time, 25 year relationship. When I've come forward in April, 2012, when Rankin, Tony Rankin is running the clock out on serving him, right? They stipulate to go ahead. That's when Joel Silver leaves right there. When Mike oh. Lang leaves. Pretty telling, isn't it? Here's what he sends the ex, the Honey Pot wife. This picture of the bed, he's moving into his multi-million dollar Soho club in Swickham, Washington, most expensive, oldest historic property. And there's his shaving kit on the bed, not even made. Shows he's moving in, right? 